Surprise! Yeah, I remember, I think it was last week, I feel like last week, but I don't know what it was, where Scott Stanley sprung up a new question from Freshwana without much warning, like, at all, and they did it again by the time of the episode, even though the show returned later, we'll talk about that at the end, um, they, out of nowhere, we were something that was, like, rumored, the Gogo was showing up on a few schedule, and that episode did indeed air. Um, it did not show up on my DVR. Go fuck it, didn't record it. And I and a big communication uh, when the episode got I I was getting I was awake at the time. It was like in early afternoon, by five or two. But yeah, yeah, I was there. But the communication of what time it was going, I missed it. Go yay! Now to now, Connor fan, and go the 18th episode of the King again, and the cup go air a proper way then. Um, that come have been 13 up code, and the 14th aired, but it got to go to be 18 up code, and it goes around that according to, um, a current family, that's what this is going to be official air date, unless they are air date the one before that. So I could wait until then, but because it aired officially, I got it. You know, I not go out. I watch over our daily motion gun gal. Like again, if they didn't mark it, they probably don't plan to re-air it until we push air. Go, hey, my one. And if you prefer to wait new push air day to watch it, that's fine. You know, for all none of you who watch me. But I kind of watch the episode of Yakety Cats, written by Michael P. Vaughn and Will Fogg. So reply here that um. Pick my gift called for a new instrument that comes from the Akakistan, that bagpipe horn thing, and she really liked playing it. It's too bad that she's pretty bad at it, and they're afraid to tell her that she's really bad at it because she likes doing it. And it doesn't sound familiar to that because, well, only if it's a kind of cliche plot, it's one they actually already did early in the Kingdom with Horseplay, which they do point out. I didn't even really like it until they explicitly mentioned it. And like, but they do, they do. You get to try to, yeah, you know, avoid some stuff happening in that one. But go, but anyway, look up go. Eh, yeah, I, I don't know. But we kind of plot. I feel like can, I don't know. We kind of plot. It's like you work play by do away it. It just put a more things bit on the story instead of just straightforward doing it. And the problem here, they're doing it twice in one game. And even though they do, they do point it out, it just don't feel well repetitive, and, and it, more, it goes through the They eventually, about the halfway point, you know, not, they don't wait till the end, it's the halfway point, because we have to play, they do tell her, do tell her, you know, in a gently way, and then call Pink Body, they can get the print and want to leave Pony you know, yeah, you know, because, you know, of knowing that her bad, Playing kind of annoying everyone. Um, and, and like I get what they're going for in the cup of code, you know, but yeah, you know, and the, but the thing of the whole mantra, we're trying to mind her all things she can be good at, but it doesn't really cure it. Go, so, purring bad is one thing, and like knowing that everyone believes she's bad, one thing to sort of. I don't know, I find that kind of weird. Especially, the thing is, she genuinely been kind of, like, the first, like, half of her playing badly, which is that kind of gets old. Um, and she is genuinely a little annoying to them, like, she, and there are two times where they might not want it to play, you know? And I don't think it'd be unworld for her to not play with one instrument that they can get, right? Because there are instruments you can get at, like, we can get her, like, on occasion to go, like, yeah, like, they totally understand the intent here, but I feel like they could have done it better, especially against the good out of the thing. I don't think in the world that the cool thing that she's doing, she ain't gonna be that great at. And the solution they come up at the end, you go, look okay. Um, we do go back to Akak fan, which was neat. But the actual solution felt for them. Wow, we have to end it, like, oh, that's the end. Okay. Like, 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 I was just not on board for, like, half of it, because it was, like, like, what was saying, more of annoying, 
And I think they go got to tell her she didn't prove the gun half when they tried to tell a little more of the story. But um but I had a whole like, story I knew before even the even the way they did it. I feel like it was a better way they could have done it. They could have had a beef solution where, you know, like you actually know, enjoyed doing it but annoying other people. I don't know. They could have found a balance, you know. You know, between her enjoying things young and the, the other people, it's like, we could find that one. I don't think, as we dig a fan from time to because other people, you know, but, you know, I don't know. We could find a better balance than they really didn't, you know. They could go out of that and should play for a lot of it. We could have it become a more interesting, but, I don't know, not great written. And I'll go, and because of one joke and a little annoying, yeah, not too much of a humor. Mark and Cameo. And I do like the joke she gave, so and a lot of times they try to cheer up pretty new and go. Yeah, they'll make up a code, um yeah, I can gag it was fine. I can't I can't even debatable because it's like it's a big step of code because I appreciate even though we have to have a code, doing a ping pong and on a purple level is kinda of interesting idea. And I do like a couple of the bits here. It just feels like the same before, but it's not a true story, and it's sort of blank, which is weak, a like story, I mean. You know, and I do feel like it's just wrecking with having fine generally in one of other people, that are just playing a valley of I don't know, we could strike a better balance between with the moral and like, but I don't, but some people will not mind it's a few positive because all the people are play. And then what we really do at the end, like, you know, go up to it for some people, but for me, it's like, I don't know, it's just, I just wouldn't think about it. It feels like I could have struck my back a lot better than that, and, you know, I feel like the whole point, I feel like it would be a better take on the me and Bowie back with the same story, you know? But, oh well, come. I prefer to make the issue go for the beginning. Uh, but, uh, break a breakdown with better than before. Because I will not local shake and the guy found more entertaining value in it. But, you know, the look one is more annoying and not particularly interesting, but I don't think it's too bad. I could have, yeah, not more junk for who. <laughs> and I guess they did the one because we knew what was going to say, maybe. It's not compared to me, I'm going to be fucking You know, well, I want to know. <laughs> Okay, here we go. Uh, Gift of a Mod Pine. That was a good one. Uh, check day off. I think I'll go pay. Um, you play point of view, that was pretty good. Uh, Fair Philly, I really liked that one. Um, that the Dick Corner Harmony, I really liked that one. Go back to I ended up really liking. Um, and then the one. Yeah, we can go we can pull in the far, I think. Yeah, that's a pretty track record of one week But anyway, go. The show officially come back on August 4th with two episodes, one of which it got hard for an episode. Hard for me in August, everybody. Go. Yeah, go. We all got three episodes of the show. And that being on the week, officially air, I can just skip it. Yeah, I can just go. Yeah, there you go, yeah, I can kind of kind of disappointing for the few episodes that I'm thinking of trying, but. I don't know, I got a few in August 4th for, for a matter of smoke in the heartwarming club. Go, yeah, uh, more like what I got. Bye.